This is Taking Stock on Bloomberg. I'm Pim Fox. Now, we've been speaking about Europe. Now let's shift our attention to Asia and economic growth. My next guest runs a worldwide distributor, U.S.-based, of medical, dental, and veterinary supplies. And he says he sees big opportunities in India and China, where they reportedly graduate 10,000 dentists every year. Here for our CEO sit-down is Stan Bergman. He's the chief executive of Henry Schein. Stan, good to have you with us. Thanks Gracias. so much for coming in. You made it all the way down from Albany, New yes, York, where yes. you were attending a dental association yes. meeting. Thanks yes, so the much New York for being State here. Dental Association. Now, good to be let, here. Let, let's talk about you know this idea of growth because we always focus on the idea that American companies are fighting overseas for the opportunity, particularly in emerging markets. Now, you've yes. been spending some time sussing out the possibilities in India and in China. What do you think the future lies for you? Pema, I, I think there's huge opportunity for American healthcare products providers in Asia, and specifically in the developing world. We have the technology, we have the know-how, and our products are respected, the brands are respected, and we have committed to advancing our pr programs in China to create the first national dental distribution company in China. Now, that's going to be a challenge, though, right? Because it's a fragmented situation yes. where you have a lot of single practitioners. They don't have the advanced consolidation that yeah. even in the United States it remains fragmented. How are you going to do this? Well, th th there are a lot of practitioners that are operating out of uh, government hospitals today. Uh, so that is, there's a big shift towards the private sector, as there is with everything in China. And we want to be there for these emerging private practitioners as they become important. Uh, the good news is the competition is highly fragmented. Hundreds of small distributors that carry a few items. We've just come out with our very first Henry Schein catalog, the first comprehensive catalog of dental products in China, and we launched at the Be Beijing show last week. So we are now well positioned with next day delivery to a number of cities in China with Henry Schein quality service and quality logistics. Has that always been the quandary for you, is that the distribution networks in China, in India, they are not as sophisticated, they're not yeah. as mature, obviously, as they are in the United States or the UK or yeah. New Zealand or Australia where you operate. Well, yes, uh, what we usually do as a company is we usually joint venture into a new market. We find the leading player, uh, or one of the leading players, and then we'll partner with them. There really is, there wasn't much of an opportunity in China. There was such an opportunity in Hong Kong, but really not in China. So by and large, we've greenfielded ourselves into China because really there is no one to partner with. It's all small players, and they don't always comply with regulations. And we're committed to comply with all the Chinese regulations, which are quite complex. Now, what about in India? Do you see opportunity there too? Yes, there is opportunity, tremendous opportunity in India uh, for dental products. The middle class is 100 million people, maybe more. Could it be as many as 200. But we've elected this moment to focus on uh, East Asia, on, um, uh, on China, Hong Kong, and a couple of other countries. And then we'll also focus on India, uh, perhaps in a couple of years from now. Tell me about technology, because all right, we know about distributing dental products. You go into a dentist's office, even in the United States, the dentist is probably going to have gotten some of their products through Henry Schein. But the technology, the platform that you're making available to the dentist itself, that's also changing the way that the practitioner operates. Yes. I, I just addressed two graduating class of dentists, and I gave them my view, which is in the past five years, technology has rapidly advanced. But in the next two or three years, it'll advance even faster. The digital highway is being built in dentistry. The dentist taking an electronic impression sending that impression along a highway to a lab where the lab will mill the products electronically that's the pieces are there it's got to be constructed and we're rushing to do that that also the, the, those impressions that are taken in the chair can be moved chair side and a crown or bridge milled chair side dentistry is advancing r extremely fast all right well as always it's a pleasure to have you stan bergman chief executive of henry shine thanks so much for your views Thank you. appreciate it